Hello everyone and welcome to a brand new episode of, you guessed it, Charlie Go. As you know, I'm Charlie Go, and as you may not know, this right here, this little girl doesn't like me making too many videos because she likes to get all the attention, but this right here is Miss Layla. I talk about her all the time and she is always wanting to join me in opening Pokemon cards, but she's probably only going to last for the intro. So I just wanted to introduce everyone to Miss Layla. Um, and she is one that you may hear every once in a while in the background uh, meowing at me, asking me to stop opening Pokemon cards and playing with her and she's already gone. So as I expected, <laughs> but that doesn't mean she'll stay quiet because she is kind of getting tired of me opening, but it's okay, I gave you plenty of attention. Uh, <laughs> She gets all the love, don't worry. Um, but like I was saying, as you know, I'm Charlie Go. Thank you guys so much for joining me. If you're brand new, welcome. Really, really hope that you choose to join our amazing community by hitting that subscribe button. And you can also hit the like button and leave a comment and let me know, you know, tell me that you're brand new or tell me what your favorite pool was or tell me a fun fact about Pokemon, ask me a question, whatever it is, just throw that in the comment section or all of the above. I love to get to interact with everybody as who are part of this community. Also make sure you're following our social media accounts. We have Instagram, TikTok, and Twitter. And whenever you follow those, at least one, but hopefully all of them, you get early access to at least one code card from the next upcoming video prior to the video being aired. So that means that you get to see a early access clip, but you also get early access to the code card, which means you could get it before anybody else does, um, which is why you need to follow that or any of those social media accounts. And that'll also give you access to early updates um, of whenever we do live videos or any other changes that might happen. But that's a great place for you to see any updates for this channel. Now that that's over, today we are going to be doing something a little different. I kind of hinted at this a couple weeks ago, but um, we're finally going to get to do it. And I've hinted at it actually, I think before. If you know uh, any of my background at all, I am fairly new to Pokemon World. I'm about a year and a half in. So I started this channel not only to get to open Pokemon cards, of course, because that's so much fun, but to get to become part of this community, learn more, and fall in love even further with Pokemon than I already am. And one of my first introductions to the Pokemon world, apart from a random opening that I did and off camera that sparked the interest, but also started watching Sun and Moon, the season of Pokemon. And sorry guys, I heard Layla making a little noise and it got me a little bit nervous, so I needed to make sure she was okay. Anyways, I told you she'd be looking for attention right now because I'm filming a few videos in a row because I'm about to move back uh, for the summer for an internship. And so she's not enjoying that very much because it's taking away from her time of attention. So but she's gonna get all the attention she needs after this is done. So don't worry about that. But anyways, I was talking about Sun and Moon and the fact that that was one of the first seasons I watched. I know totally out of order, but it was something that really sparked that interest in me. So whenever I saw a place to purchase Sun and Moon uh, materials or Pokemon cards or anything from that set, I got really, really excited. And one of those things is, actually two of those things, we are going to be opening today. So we'll be opening a Sun and Moon Elite Trainer Box, the Solgaleo edition. So there is a Solgaleo edition and also a Lunala, which are the two evolutions um, that stem from the same evolutionary Pokemon, uh, but they tend to evolve into either Solgaleo or Lunala, which is really cool. Um, so we're gonna start out with the Solgaleo Elite Trainer Box, and in a couple episodes, we will complete this with the Lunala one. So today, we're gonna start off with that, as well as we're going to be opening this fantastic blister pack, which has, well, I guess it does have a little Lunala pin right there. So you'll get a sneak peek of that, but you get to see Solgaleo and, you know, some of our other Pokemon. But this one's from the Sun and Moon original set, and this is from the Crimson Invasion portion of Sun and Moon. So it's very similar to the Sword and Shield set series, I guess, which originated with Sword and Shield, but then they had multiple different sets within Sword and Shield. So this is the Sun and Moon series, and in Crimson Invasion is a set within sun and moon so if you already knew that i apologize but it was something i had to learn over time but those are the things that we're going to be doing today really really excited about that and i already did my seal so i don't even have to do that now so without further ado let's get started 
So as you can see, we have our beautiful Solgaleo on the front of this Sun and Moon Elite Trainer box. I have been holding on to this for way too long and I'm super excited to open it. So let's go ahead and get this plastic off. Oh, goodness gracious. Um, Sun and Moon will always have a place in my heart or a special place in my heart because that was the first full season that I, I watched. But I did go back and I am in the process of watching through all of them. Now I can't seem to figure out, so season 10, for anyone who's watched all of the seasons, season 10, um, there's a specific Pokemon channel that you can watch through Amazon and I'm missing 10.02 and 10.03. So it goes 10.01, 10.02, 10.03, 10.04, but it's all part of season 10. Um, and within those 10.01, 10.02, 10.03, there are multiple episodes. And I finished 10.01 and for some reason, I can't find anywhere that has 10.02 and three. So it, I had to skip those to get to 10.04, which drives me nuts because I know I'm missing something. Sorry, I had to point that out. So if anyone knows how to watch that, let me know, please, because it's driving me nuts. I don't like missing things. Okay, so in this, you'll see that you'll get the eight Pokemon TCG Sun and Moon booster packs, 65 card sleeves featuring Sogaleo or Lunala. 45 Pokemon TCG energy cards, a player's guide, six damage counter die, a competition legal coin flip die, two acrylic condition markers, and one acrylic GX marker, a collector's box to hold everything with four dividers to keep it organized, and a code card, which all of those code cards within this will go to you. So because I am not super, super familiar with the set because I wasn't involved in the Pokemon world when it originally came out, this is really exciting for me because I get to actually see what's technically in this set for the first time because I've opened Sun and Moon before but I didn't ever have an opportunity to go through this guide which is really cool and whenever you get any elite trainer box for whatever set that you open it'll come with one of these guides which tells you you know this is all new Pokemon and Pokemon GX so it tells you about the Alola region and what Pokemon GX is so you can just see Lunala GX, uh, Primarina GX, Decidueye GX, uh, looks like there's a Lorantis GX. Um, so if you want to go through these, hopefully I'm giving you some semblance of opportunity to actually pause it um, and see what's inside. I will take the time to read it also later, but I don't want to go through all of that, obviously, since we don't have a whole lot of time. But let me just go ahead and skip through. There's our top trainer cards. Here's our card list. So this gives us an, a glimpse into all the cards that can be pulled from Sun and Moon, which is super cool. There's your Decidueye GX, the Lorantis GX. Ooh, there's an Incineroar GX. That's super cool, um, which is obviously the evolved form of Litten, which is one of the three starter Pokemon in the Alolan region. Uh, Primarina GX. There's our Lunala GX. And of course, all of our other fantastic... Oh, we've got a... Whoa, an Umbreon GX, super awesome. A Solgaleo GX, of course. Uh, and then, oh, I see our Eevee, of course. Oh, and there's a Taurus GX. We had a Gumshoes GX. Wow. Oh, look at that. We got a, another Lurantis GX, a Lapras GX, and an SP. Oh my goodness, look at all these. Whoa. Oh, I am so excited. Oh my goodness, there's an Espeon GX Rainbow Rare. And an Umbreon one, Lunala, Sogaleo. Oh my goodness. So many amazing things that can be pulled. Wow. Okay, really excited. Even more excited than I already was. Anyways, um, so then it comes with this awesome sleeve on the outside. Yep, and it's the same as normal. And on the inside of these sleeves for the box is actually artwork that you can use to, you can open this up, you know, see right there, there's like a little split right there that you can open it up and you can hang it on your wall. You can make it an art. Um, for your room or whatever it is, um, which is really cool as well. And this box is different than some of the newer ones because it's it's textured. So the newer ones are really, really smooth and shiny. So that's really cool as well. So we're getting an experience that we don't normally get in the newer sets. Um, really, really fun. Fits the Thea Loveland region. Oh, and there is my very first GX token, which is super awesome. And then look at these die, really awesome. You get to see that sun and moon symbol right there. It's not see-through like we've seen with some of them, but it's really, really cool. I love the coloration. It matches everything perfectly. Then like anything else, like any other Elite Trainer box, you open it up like that and you get all of your booster packs. And what else is in here? There's another one. 
And there is your code card that we'll be saving for the end, so don't go anywhere. Sorry, I was covering up with that. <laughs> and these are your dividers. There's another one in here that's falling down. Um, and so if you decided to use this as the Elite Trainer Box box as a holder for your cards, you could use these as the dividers um, to keep it organized. There is your Solgaleo sleeves, which I always like to use the sleeves for the Elite and all your energy that you get um, for the actual Elite Trainer Box from which they came because that also keeps me organized and helps me remember what I pulled from what you know, box, which is kind of fun. Okay, let me put all this stuff back in here. And there we go. There is our Elite Trainer Box in all of its glory. I'm really excited about this. Okay, I've been holding on to this for way too long. And don't forget, we're gonna get our blister, our blister on in a little bit. Um, but first, let's go ahead and open up some Elite Trainer Box packs. So let me go ahead and open these really cool. I love having, I love that they put these sleeves in with the late Friday boxes. So I'm going to mix these up like I normally do. Um, but the difference is, is this time I'm coming in completely blind. I've opened up some Sun and Moon, but I never looked up what all is in Sun and Moon um, and what is a potential, a possibility. And now we've opened some of them uh, or looked at some of them from that trainer guide, but that doesn't always mean that we know everything that there is to find within this set. So I'm really excited about this because even the, the pack art is going to be new to me. And if you haven't opened Sun and Moon or it's been a while, it'll either be new to you or a great reminder. So let's see. Okay. Oh, we're starting off with an Incineroar Sun and Moon pack. I'm so excited about this. Okay. Here we go. Oh, this is so much fun. I love going back through some sets that we haven't seen in a while. Makuhita, very nice. I don't know, I feel like it's the same card trick, but let's see, there is your code card, your first of many. I believe it's this card trick, so if I mess it up on the first one, I apologize ahead of time. Let's see, nope, okay. Uh, oh, so it's two? I don't know. Let's see. First energy, fighting energy. <laughs> we have Steeny. I love it. Hurtier. Charger Bug. Makuhita. Caterpie. Paris. Young Goose. Shelder. <gasps> Ooh. Okay. Here's another thing that I really love about some of these sets is you get to see the difference in some of that reverse hollows or some of those reverse hollows, which are so cool. And I wish they did some more of that, which where it's not all the same with the stripes of the type, which is fine, but these are super cool. A reverse holo Golbat in three, two, and a Whirlwind Mock. Oh my goodness. Oh wow, I thought I saw something. I wasn't quite sure though, look at that. And what I really love about how they did this holo was that they made Muck himself or itself non hollow and the backdrop is what is hollow, which really makes Muck stand out. That is so cool. Oh, I almost went for the wrong sleeve. So you gotta put these on there. Yes, first pack magic. Wow. Oh, and I do like these sleeves because they're more clear than some of the newer ones. That's really awesome. Okay, first pack magic starting us off right. Now with most things uh, Pokemon related, having a elite trainer box, unlike a booster box, you don't, you're not promised anything. So that could be the only pull that we get. But that's totally fine with me because I, I love it regardless. So this is really exciting. Um, but with a booster box, you're promised at least one secret rare, which is really cool. Um, but with, you know, elite trainer boxes, it's like taking a bunch of random booster packs and putting them, it's like buying them on the shelf or off the shelf where you don't know. You could get all amazing pools or you could get nothing. Um, I say nothing because Pokemon cards aren't nothing. But what I mean is, is like you could get no big, nothing more than reverse hollows. Let me move this. Sorry. Okay, there is your next code card. Three to the back. No. It's two to the back. Wait. Did I? Oh, I accidentally put four to the back, I guess, last time. Okay, so we got water energy. I'm so confused. Poison Barb. Tease, team Skull Grunt. Passimian. Zubat. Oh, Poplio. Stuffle. Wingle. Oh, Dratini. I love Dratini. Oh my goodness, we got a timer ball reverse hollow and three, two, 
and a Cosmom. Whoa. Now that's a regular, but still. And that's where I believe, if I remember correctly, that's where you get your Lunala or Solgaleo is the Cosmom, which starts from a Cosmog, um, which is kind of cool. So, fun fact. We got that branched evolution there. Okay, look at that. We have our Primarita. I love this pack art, it's super cool. Oh, and I see a bound suite. Okay, let's see if I can do this. Wait, what? Okay, now I'm really confused. Okay, I guess we're gonna get our energy here or our, our code card there. I, I don't know what just. <laughs> okay, let's just go from here then. Okay, we got Bound Sweet, Skarmory. Oh, a cutie fly. Drowsy, just walking alongside the beach. Rowlet. Okay, reverse holo rug and rolla. So I guess that's where our reverse holo went. And a Butterfree regular. And oh, there's our energy. Okay, so they just stuck the, <laughs> they just stuck the code card in randomly. Okay, that's fine. Um, we got our psychic energy. We got a netball. Ooh, that's so cool. A nice polywhirl and a steeny. Oh my goodness, but look how cool this rug and rolla is. I love that. That background is so awesome. Okay, I guess they'll just throw us some curveballs in here. That's totally fine with me. Here we go. And we're back to an Incineroar. I don't know what to expect from this one. Let's see if they... They did it again! <laughs> okay, let's just go with this. Uh, there is your code card. And so then I guess we're gonna do... Oh wait, that's how it always is. I don't know what's going on with my head. I'm so sorry. My brain is just not working with me today. There is another psychic energy. <gasps> wow, I'm sorry guys. I am just getting too involved into this set that I am forgetting that that is the basic way that they usually do things. I apologize. Oh, it's Snubble. So forgive me, I've been doing exams and things and so my brain is not in its right place. Oh, wow, very nice reverse holo palisand and three, two, and ooh, and an incineroar. Regular, but still awesome. So please forgive me for freaking out about that because that was actually the way it's supposed to go. I just decided to not look at it properly. Okay, we're okay, we're good. We're like halfway through and I'm finally figuring things out. Okay, Free Marina, get me back on track. <laughs> I apologize, guys. <laughs> okay. And your code card. There you go. Three to the back. And what is our energy? Oh, we got some dark energy. What's that gonna do for us? We got repel. Golbat. Don't repel our Pokemon. We need more Pokemon. <laughs> Alolan Grimer, Spiro, Grubbin, oh, Firo, Snubble, ah, and Alolan Raticate looking very evil. <laughs> uh, beware. Oh, wait, that was the reverse. <laughs> nope, I'm not on the right track yet. That was like, that was the reverse holo. There you go. Your awesome rever reverse holo, Alolan Raticate, and a beware. You guys, I'm sorry. I'm just getting way too excited about this set that I am losing it completely. Okay, we got three more to go. Let's see if I can get it together. And then we've got our blister pack, so don't go anywhere. Um, and then you get that code card. Okay, so we got a Lunala. Let's see. What do we have for your code card? There you go to the back and what energy do we get oh oh fairy energy we never get fairy energy so i'm really excited about that don't nope, usually get excited about energy but i am today okay nest ball polywhirl sandile pika peck carvana on oh, toga tomorrow a chinchu a reverse holo rowlet look how cute he is and i love that background and three two and a cloister. Look at that rowlet, that's so cute. I'm so excited, that's awesome. Another one of your starters for the Alolan region. Really excited about that. 
And second to last pack. Let's see if we get some second to last pack magic. And we've got a Decidueye, which is where your Rowlet goes when it gets big. Okay, here we go. Code card for you. Three to the back. And what is our energy? Ooh, some steel energy. Changing it up, we have Golbat, Professor Kukui, Arachnid, Fumantis. Oh, and more lol, making me go to sleep. Can't go to sleep yet. Audratini, Alolan Diglett. Oh, a reverse hollow Corsola. Look at that, a Corsola. Oh my goodness, that's beautiful. These reverse hollows are really, really awesome. I love it. And ready, three, two. And a two cannon, or a two can, but a two cannon today. <laughs> Look at that beautiful, beautiful Corsola. Corsola. Sorry. <sighs> okay, one more. We have last pack magic. I mean, we've only pulled one hollow this whole time. So, I don't know. Maybe Solgaleo is what we've been needing. We've been needing a nice Solgaleo pack. That's what it is. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, I see a Rog and Rolla. We're rock and rolling with Rog and Rolla. There is your code card. Okay, we got three to the back. Let's see what that energy is. Oh, some water energy. Perfect for Lola. Okay, let's see if we got some last pack magic for this. Okay, Pinsir, Repel. We need, we, we need Pokemon, we can't repel them. Marini, Crab Brawler, Growlithe. Oh, I love that Growlithe card. Surskit, oh, we got a Fero Reverse Hollow. Oh, that is really cool. That's already really cool artwork, and then you add in the reverse hollow, which makes it even more awesome. Okay, ready? Three, two, five! No! What? Okay, wow! Oh my goodness, great centering and everything! We just got the Espeon GX! <gasps> That's amazing! Okay, let me put this in a protector. Whoa! I just found out that they have this one in this set, and I'm already like, that was definitely a chase for me. Oh my goodness, we got the last pack magic, you guys. And it's not even the last pack, but that's perfect last pack magic for this. Oh my goodness, that is awesome. Okay, and this beautiful Spiro Reverse Hollow. How perfect. Oh my goodness. Okay, so remember, we're not done yet. Don't go anywhere. We have this beautiful blister right here for you guys really quickly. So let's go ahead and open this and then don't worry, you'll get your code card. <laughs> okay, let's see what we've got in here. We've got a sun and moon. And then we have a sun and moon crimson invasion. Then we have this beautiful beautiful tin look at that that is oh, that, look at that that is amazing oh i love that i love collecting pins and this is a perfect addition to that collection really excited about that okay okay so i didn't oh, pull these from that elite trainer box so i'll go ahead and put this these sleeves down even though i want to keep using them i'll use my regular sleeves so we're going to start with the crimson invasion Silvali on the front, which is the one that you can actually change out its type by throwing in. I think they're like look like little CDs, which is kind of cool. Okay, oh, there is your code card, and let's see three to the back. Let's see if this is right. Yes, okay, some psychic energy. So we got a five. Oh, perfect! There's Savali, uh, our Savali GX, I guess. This card is attached to a Fighting Memory, Devoured Field. Oh, a Gastrodon. Oh, Swablu. Mid Flight, Spoink, Chimeco. Oh, Jigglypuff. Execute. Oh, look at that! Reverse Hollow Skiddo. Skiddo with the kiddo. <laughs> Okay, ready, three, two, and a crawdot. Very nice, but look at that, that's so cute. I love it. Makes me want a little baby goat. You ever seen those little baby goats in pajamas? That would be me, I would definitely do that. 
<laughs> okay, we have one more. We have last pack magic. Come on, Solgaleo, bring us some last pack magic. Let's see. If not, we've had a lot of magic, definitely. And getting to open these has been so much fun. And we're not done yet. We still have another Elite Trainer box that'll be coming in, I think, two weeks. Um, that will be opening in, I think, two weeks. There we go, there is your code card. So be on the lookout for that, which will be so much fun. Okay, finishing off with an Electric Energy. Lima. Oh, a Dragonair, changing it up. A Double Colorless Energy. Flitten. A oh, Torkoal. Young Goose. Oh, Rowlet. Hey, Cosmog. Reverse Holo, Growlithe, looking fantastic and super cute and ready. Three, two, and a Holo Crobat finishing off on a Holo. Perfect, absolutely amazing. Oh, great, great pulls, you guys. I know we haven't, we didn't get like all pulls from this set, but it was definitely worth opening with you guys because it, this is a lot of fun. And I think the way that they did these reverse hollows at this point was almost like getting a hollow because they're really beautiful um they really did intricate work with the backdrop of the reverse hollow let's go ahead and look through these before i go into or give you your final code card here we go so here are our reverse hollows we have growlith we have skiddo Firo, chrysala rowlith Radicate alolan style palisand rug and rolla timer ball and a goal bat and then of course our fantastic big pools which still blowing my mind uh even though we didn't get a whole lot of them they were really awesome we have crobat we have the alolan muck and we have the espion gx how crazy is that and of course we can't forget your final code card okay i hope you guys enjoyed that as much as i did that was something i've been waiting on for a while and i was really excited to get to open with you guys it's perfect timing to get to do this in the middle of two big set releases we just finished off with the brilliant stars and moving into the brand new set that either has already come out or is about to come out astral radiance um which we'll be doing on this channel uh but for right now really hope you enjoyed kind of a throwback memory of sun and moon which is something really special to me hopefully it is to you too if you're brand new like i said at the beginning thank you so much for joining me if you're not and you've been here before thank you again for coming back really really enjoy having you as part of this community if you haven't already i hope you hit that subscribe button and the like button and make sure to follow us on social media for, we have instagram tiktok and twitter and that is where you'll get all the charlie go updates and know when there'll be a live video but that will be in addition to our weekly video which happens every Wednesday at noon central standard time or one of these other time zones whichever time matches your time zone that is the time on Wednesday that a brand new episode will be airing every Wednesday so you don't want to miss that and it'll also if you follow us on social media you'll get that early access to those code cards and you'll get to figure out whenever there are updates to Charlie Go channel or if there's a live episode thank you guys again for joining me for this brand new episode and I hope to see you next time on Charlie Go bye guys